we had uh, geometry and algebra and history and geography and just the usual things that they take. What was your favorite type of class? Oh, let's see. Really, I think I liked the, the, the mathematical classes better than... Really? Yeah. Physics. We had physics. We did experiments in physics class. Do you remember the experiments? Oh, I don't remember them, no. I just knew that we, we tried things out. Did you ever blow anything up? Uh, no. <laughs> no, I didn't. Now, now, Uncle Pat went to the same high school, right? Yes, he did. But he had already graduated when you... He was, he was a year four ahead. years ahead of me. Yeah. He graduated, and then I started that yeah. fall. Did he play basketball when he was there? Did he what? Play basketball? Did did he play basketball? No. Well, he uh, he did for a while, but they caught him smoking. Oh. So they, they yeah, <laughs> took him off in the team. So they just for smoking, they wouldn't let him play. Yeah. Really. That's right. Now did now did, was that okay with him or did it bother him getting booted off the team? Oh, he didn't care. He, I don't remember that he cared very much. He didn't, he just decided well he was not it. That's all. And he went with. Uh, uh, there was a kid that lived in town there, named Austin Miller. He liked to come out to the farm, and uh, he'd come out and and stay with Pat on the farm part of the time. <laughs> now, now your uh, your your nephew Mac, yeah, was. Uh, what, five years younger than you? Uh, seven. Seven years younger than you. Okay. So he he didn't go to school in that area, did he? Not in Madrid. No, he went out there at, uh, at the, on the farm. And uh, he, he got to go in with some kids in Des Moines that his mother didn't like very well. And so she uh, sent him out to the farm, and he he lived there with my folks for about a year, I think. Uh -huh. And he went to school at that little uh, Hopkins Grove school. Oh, okay. How old would he have been then? Oh, he was about. He was about twelve. Okay. Yeah. Now, now you, I remember you went to your fiftieth high school reunion. Yes. And weren't out of your fifty-six people, weren't there a pretty good bunch of them left? There were a lot of them there, and just nearly all of them were yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah, we had a really good. <coughs> Did you keep in touch with those people after you graduated? Did I? Huh? Did you did you stay friends with them after you graduated? Uh, no. <coughs> no. There, there. So, so there weren't any of those folks that you stayed in touch with after you graduated. No. Well, yes, I did too, Lillian. Lillian Steinhouse. I stayed in touch with 
And in fact, they came to see us once in Albuquerque. Oh, really? And, um, uh, but I'm sure that she's gone now. But she's, I stayed in touch with her even since I've been here. Oh, is that right? Yeah, when I, the very first year or two that I was here. Um, what was her, what was her married name? Well, I can't remember. I, I just don't remember right now what her middle, or what her married name was. But, um, she, she wrote me a letter that she's gone, I know. Yeah. <coughs> I called Aunt Jenny.